rapaziada do canal é o seguinte. Eu vou ter que segurar o tranco aqui. Entendeu? Até o avião ser ligado. Então vamos se ligar. Esse é o blacklist até o final, valeu? Ó, ó. Foi tenso aqui, hein? Vamos seguir. Vambora. Segura. Vehicle 
Hostiles approaching our position. Tá certo. Bora. Sim, hein, rapaziada. Que missão, hein? Tem um skip aqui. Acho. Bora. Our payment is clear. Tracking tanker movements in the Gulf. Coast Guard had to fly in a replacement crew on one of the ships because of food poisoning. Charlie? You guys are going to want to see this. I got some help from the peeps over at Fort Meade and backtracked the IP addresses that were tagged to the guys in Philly. You're looking at the guts of the server the engineers use for the US ops. I've got IDs, addresses. It's details. What do you mean? This is just white noise. We ran thousands of hits like this before Blacklist Zero. It's how the engineers operate, and it's not telling us what Sadiq wants from the blacklist. I thought it was to get U.S. troops off foreign soil. That's never going to happen. Sadiq knows it. What? Briggs is right. Sadiq, no, that's not fair. We're not yeah. asking the right questions. If Sadiq's not working for Iran, and he doesn't care about getting the troops, Vizier. what's his real play? Charlie, connection. Everything we have here could be compromised. Work with Briggs. Focus on the tanker and that replacement crew. That's a solid lead. You got it. Take everything we got feed into the SMI. See if we can the end of you. After. Stopping fuel doesn't get us any closer to knowing what Sidiq wants. No, but grabbing one of his people on site does. That's a big deal. Very astute. My men. They took the bait. The kid can cut anything he wants, but as of five minutes ago, Paladin was mine. Good. ETA on the tank. Offshore rendezvous with Echo Team in two hours. Target at impact site in four. Status of COG preparations. Site up is at yellow alert. DC's already sent emergency intel packets from JSOC, NSA, and State. Good. They just need one more push. Now we go for fuel. Launch it. I want the entire coast burning by the time I touch down. Let's start with Fisher's plane. He wants to know what we're after. Let's give him a taste. Time to move. Man. Bora. Tô vendo negócio aqui. Apart from some cosmetic damage, it looks like the plane is fine. It's good to hear. Charlie, what? Any update on that hijacked ship we're after? I'm still working on it. They named the attack American Fuel. A loaded tanker would make one hell of a weapon. What the hell just happened? Don't look at me. Graham. The SMI isn't responding. I'm locked up. Eita, mas... Charlie? Trying to work around. Briggs, you got anything? Nothing. All I got is lighting and internal comms. This is the flight deck. We're losing engine power. How long can we glide? We're talking minutes. Navigation systems are down. We have only manual flight controls. We're gonna check the rear panel. I can't get us up and running that fast. I don't even know how they got control of the plane. Talk to me, buddy, damn it! What's going on? This is the co-pilot. We need a medic. What's wrong? The captain cracked his head when the plane dropped. It's bad. He's unconscious. Repeat, the pilot is down. Is the plane under control? Shit. All the engines are dead. Trying to restart. 
I'm locked out of the navigation controls. Can you fly? Yes. I mean, no. I can try to keep it together manually, keep her in a glide, but I need another pilot. It takes two people to properly work the controls. Briggs, check on the pilot. Where are you going? To get Coven. Try and get the backups online. Try and remote access again. Pull the hard drives from the SMI. Water. Come on, Charlie. We need a. Hey, let me guess. We're totally fucked, and I'm the only one who can unfuck us, right? Huh? The pilot's unconscious. Shit! What happened to the co-pilot? He's flying it manually. I get it, it's a two-man job. Dump the power, kill the backup generator, reboot the system. Okay, I gotta get to the flight deck. Let me out of here, Fisher. Let me out of here. Take care of the power. Hey, dump some cargo while you're down there. It'll buy us some time. Briggs, head to the back of the plane. We need to lose cargo fast. On my way. I'm leaving Vai, cara. Tem um pouco tempo, rapaziada. Tem que liberar as cargas. Bora. I got the cargo bay door open. Wants to 
to reinstall the whole system mid-flight. Yeah, I'd be done by now if this jackass would get out of my way. He'll crash the plane. What the fuck do you think is about to happen? Let him at it. Exactly. All right. For sure. You gotta pump fuel back in the engines, all right? If I get this thing back online, we're gonna have seconds to fire it up. Manual fuel pump controls are in there. All right, once I reboot, you gotta pull back hard. Okay, we're gonna get one shot at this. Three, two, one, now! Ah, oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, you bitch, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up! What's our status? The main systems are back online. Flying, but we're flying blind. Graham, internal comms work, but the other communication systems are still offline. Hey guys, what the hell just happened? We were hit with a Stuxnet-style virus. I rebooted the SMI from backup, did a full system scrub, we're clean. How did the engineers get a virus on my plane? We'll do the forensics and get you some answers. Oh shit. What now? It's a communique we received right before the plane went dark. The White House activated continuity of government. What does that mean? It means all the top military and government brass were sent to protected bunkers to make sure they survive. Last time that happened was 9-11. Oh my god. Do you think that last blacklist attack? I don't know that yet, Charlie. Just focus on restoring communications. I think cortar tudo agora. Baseada. Vocês vão acompanhar comigo a próxima parte e não perdem. Aqui aí na sua casa. Ainda essa semana. Valeu. Vou me despedir. Perde a próxima parte, hein? Fui.